pavement, car doors, playground equipment, they're all harmless most of the time, but they can get blistering hot, literally, in Arizona's summer heat. And as our Isabel Garcia reports from our Washington Bureau, doctors are warning people to be vigilant during the summer months. In the Valley of the Sun, experts warn everyone needs to be mindful when stepping outside because the Arizona sun is not forgiving. In direct sunlight, pavement can reach 180 degrees, just below boiling. A couple seconds of contact can result in a second degree burn. A minute can cause a third degree burn. Dr. Kevin Foster from the Arizona Burn Center says those most at risk include people experiencing homelessness, out of town visitors, and elderly people. Sometimes it's medication related, and sometimes it's just simply they're um, more sensitive to the heat and um, they just don't tolerate it uh, very well. But yeah, that's the problem. They go down and then they can't get back up again. Young children are also vulnerable. And unfortunately, we see a lot of kids who get uh, burned from uh, propane and gas grills, primarily from, from touching hot substance, uh, surfaces. So it's very similar to the hot pavement burns. The Arizona Burn Center admitted 85 people with heat-related burns last summer. Seven died from their injuries. Foster said the center has already seen 15 to 20 cases this summer. With the summer holidays coming up, Dr. Foster had a specific warning for those who want to grill out. Have kids around. If you're grilling outside uh, with either a propane or, or a charcoal grill, just don't have kids around um, because you never know when they're going to walk up and touch something. There are common sense steps you can take to protect yourself, including with protective clothing, sturdy shoes, and socks. In Washington, Isabel Garcia, Cronkite News.